Adventure time! Come on, grab your friends. We'll go to very distant lands. We'll take the dog and then the kill and the book. We'll never end this adventure time. Gross, dude. That wood will make a good bridge, eventually. Nice! Bet you can use those handlebars for picking up all sorts of things. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Where there's a well, there's a way to get water. <laughs> That'll be boiling hot in no time. Of course, we can't pick it up now. We can put the hot towel on the ice to melt it, if we can get it out of the can. Cool! Or hot, actually. Uh, you got the towel out of the water. Drop it on the ice! A wall of ice! Whatever that hairy beast is, it must have walled itself up in this tree. Sounds sad. I don't care. It has to be stopped. We need to find a way to melt through this ice. <laughs> Ice King? You're the hairy beast that's been messing with people? We're gonna take you down, man! <sighs> I'll just sit here and be miserable while you do whatever it is you have to do. Finn, hold off. I think something's going on here. Algebraic! Yeah! Ice King, we need to ask you some questions. Go ahead. Ask anything you want. I got nothing but time. What are you doing living in the woods? Well, I was away from the Ice Kingdom for a while on a book tour. Somebody invited me to do a reading of my entire Fiona and Cake series. Can you believe it? No. Oh. Well, anyway, the nice lady that called me to arrange the tour uh, didn't meet me. After a couple of days, I went back to the Ice Kingdom and found out I'd been kicked out. Kicked out? Why? Somebody anonymously tipped off Pillow Mint Butler that I left my kingdom abandoned, so a new leader had to be appointed in my place. Pillow Mint Butler, the guy who helped select Nightmare Princess to rule the Nightmare Kingdom. Yeah, yeah, that's the guy. Anyway, he said he's in the process of installing a princess to take over the Ice Kingdom. He picked Lumpy Space Princess. She was the only one available on short notice. This place is seriously nasty, dude. Yeah, well, what are you gonna do? I'm a hobo now. People have been talking about a hairy beast that's terrorizing them lately. Is that you? Well, I guess I am a little hairy, but I've been thinking of getting a body wax. Ew! Just tell us why you've been stealing stuff and messing with people. I was hungry. And lonely. So very lonely. Uh... LSP in charge of a kingdom sounds like a bad idea. She'd be even worse than you are at ruling a kingdom. Uh, thanks, I guess. Maybe we can fix this. What can we do to help? Oh, thanks, bro. But I don't know if there's anything you could... Hey, wait. You might not be able to get my kingdom back, but you can help. This is a chance for us to live together at the treehouse again. Three bros living together, having fun. The three Amig bros. What do you say? No, 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 no. We'll get your kingdom back. Finn and Jake Investigations is on the case. Oh, okay. I guess I'll just ice myself back in my tree cave and wait for you guys to do your thing. Alone. Cold. Hairy.
Ugh, all right, Ice King. You can stay with us, just until we sort this out and get your kingdom back. Really? Great! Uh, just let me collect my stuff. Um, I think you can leave it. We got plenty of garbage at home. Whatevs! This'll be so much fun! Dibs on Finn's bed! I regret this already. I'm so glad you let me stay here. I never told you when I was staying here before, but I really envy you guys. Um, sure. No problem, Ice King. We... But there's always room for improvement. Ice King, if you want to get your kingdom back, you have to let me and Jake go and investigate what's happening. Yeah, sure. Don't let me keep you. You do what you gotta do. Great. We'll just be going now. Just as soon as we get things ironed out here on the home front, when you're ready, let me know. I've got a detailed list. Finn, he's never gonna let us leave. I know, man. We gotta think of something. Guess we should start by finding out what he wants. Oh, good. You guys are ready to get started. Here's my list. A jar of Prismo's pickles? Sorry, man. We ate the last one of those a while ago. Then why is there a full jar under Jake's pillow? Jake! You've been bogarting a jar of Prismo pickles? That's low, bro. Um, maybe we should circle back to the pickle thing later. Your own guest suite? What the? Dude, we don't have a guest suite. Way ahead of you. I've already called the contractors. They start the build out next week. Uh, meanwhile, I'll just crash on your bed. My bed? Where am I supposed to sleep? Well, this place is lousy with sofas. You can pick whichever one you want. I'm easy. Gee, thanks. An invitation to movie night? Huh, that seems reasonable. Great, I get first pick. Basic Mortality, season two. It's 22 episodes, so you better have plenty of popcorn. That's cool, I haven't seen that season yet. Oh, it's great. The lady detective dies in episode 15. It's really sad. I cried and cried. Oops, spoiler alert. Hey. <laughs> Sigh. A sandwich? Well, that doesn't seem so tough. But it's got to be a good sandwich with lots of meat and cheese and mustard. Oh, and olives. The green kind, not the black kind. Black kind of nasty. Okay. But we're kind of low on groceries. If you want, Jake and me can go to the Grocery Kingdom and... Oh, that's okay. I don't want to make you run out on my account. We can get back to the sandwich later. Let's see if there's anything else. A princess? Ice King, we are not gonna help you kidnap princesses. Yeah, I thought that might be a sticking point. But I'm so lonely. How about a play date like last time? I don't know, Africa Daniel's been to a lot lately. He's probably pretty tired. Oh, not him. He's a donkus anyway. I miss Gunter. Can you invite Gunter to come over? If I had Gunter to keep me company, all the other stuff on the list could wait. Really? Well, I guess we can give him a call. Finn, Gunter will wreck the place. He breaks bottles. About half our coolest stuff is in bottles. Don't worry. We don't have to really invite Gunter over. We just need to fool Ice King into thinking Gunter is here. We can come up with something. We're on it, Ice King! One play date with Gunter coming up! Just laying around, do do de do Hey, Bimo, you want Ice King out of here, right? Of course! Ice King smells funny, and he calls Bimo Neptar. Yeah, well, me and Jake have to find a way to get Ice King his kingdom back, but he won't let us leave. How do you feel about costumes? Bimo loves wearing costumes. We need your help. Yay! Bimo loves to help. Do you like penguins? Yes, penguins are very cute and they waddle when they walk, like a beemo. 
You like to play, right? Of course! Bima is the game machine! In a very literal sense. Great! Here's the deal. We want you to dress up like Gunther and go on a play date with Ice King. It's only for a few hours, so me and Finn can go out and find a way to get Ice King out of our house for good. I see. No. Aw, come on, Bimo! Take one for the team! No! You and Jake left me out of your detective agency, and you brought a smelly dunkers to live in our home. Bimo is cranky. Maybe if Bimo was in a better mood, Bimo would help. <sighs> All right, we get it. Come on, Jake. Let's see if we can find something to cheer up Bimo so he'll help us. Hmm, sturdy. Sure beats kicking it in the woods. Bimo is too angry to help you with your silly penguin disguise plan. Hey Bimo! I think we found something that will cheer you up. No one die! This is Bimo's favorite. Put it in. Dance, dance, dance! Um, I don't hear anything. And I got dog ears. I can hear real good. Bimo is using internal earphones. Okay, Finn. Bimo is in a good mood now. I will dress as a penguin and play with the smelly ice king. You're the best, Bimo. We'll get started when we have all the stuff for the costume. Yeah, let's see. We're gonna need a couple of brushes, some black and white paint, something to make a beak. Oh, and some fake eyes. Gunther's got those big old bug eyes. Ready to paint something white? You have got some painting skills. Ready to paint something black! Don't forget under his arms! Hey! There is something in there! Meat man, meatballs. They're the best. Kinda look like eyes when they're old like those are. Voila! Two penguin peepers! Now that it's rolled and glued, the card looks kind of like a little party hat, or a beak. That looks just like a tiny beak. Perfect. Hey, Ice King, look who came over for a play date. Wink. Gunter, Daddy's missed you so much. Oh, sweetie, we are going to have so much fun. There's so much to do here. I bet these guys...